landscape here, apart from the background noise. Some of the lawn, I can't do much about that. So they were at five dock on the shore for a short while. We're going to try some earthworms on the jig head. Okay, it's probably cheating using live bait on a jig head, but we're going to give it a flick on the flicker and see how it goes. Plus, I'm going to put some on the bait rod and lob it out. Just a bay area. About one metre tide, 1.5 in about an hour and a half. Gee, it's noisy this morning, bloody hell. Did you get any noisy around here? So anyway, let's get started, put some earthworms on the jig head, throw them about, see what sort of fish we can get. We'll try a slow retrieve. Plus, I'll put the bait line out as well to see what gets hits first. All right, got a couple of worms in the old bait line. Not sure what size sinker. Cast out a bit, leave it to sit there while we get the jig head set up. That's probably one, I don't know. 10 metres out, that'll do. Right, let's get the jig head going. Do one worm through. Quarter ounce jig head, six pound line. Nothing spectacular. And this is just try a slow retrieve. Look at that, got hit straight away. Yep, gone in one hit. Getting thumped hard, probably because it's a live worm. More nibbles. Come on. Take your damn hook. Bait line's getting hit hard, look at that. Something's on that. Something on that. Trusty bait line. Yep, look at that. Something's on that one. Worms. That's decent actually. That's a decent brim. There you go. Do garden worms do the job? Yes, they do. Look at that. We've got a brim. Oh, yes, finally. Here we go. Got something on the jig head on it. Oh, yeah, on off, on off, on off. I know. Real thing. Off. Did have something on. Try again. Yes, got one. Stay on. Finally. They're not very big, but still. Earthworm on a jig head. What have we got? Flounder. Okay. There we go. We have a flounder on the jig head. 